The International Monetary Fund has a data set called International Financial Statistics, or IFS, that is incredibly useful for finding international economic data. You can find the Consumer Price Index, Gross Domestic Product, Exchange Rates, and more for countries all over the world. Click the Data by Country option if you are only interested in a brief overview of the economic state of a specific country. For instance, I'm interested in learning more about Austria's economy. By clicking Country, I can limit to a country of my choice. The graphs will automatically update. I can click the wheel icon in the top right corner of any graph to share, print, or export the image. If you're interested in a specific economic indicator, click the Data by Indicator option. Then click Indicator to select the data you want to retrieve. For example, I'm interested in finding international data on the Consumer Price Index. So I'm going to click Prices, Consumer Prices, Consumer Price Index. Again, the graphs will automatically update. I can click the years at the bottom of the top graph to change the data I'm viewing. Again, I can click the wheel icon in the top right corner of any graph to share, print, or export the image. If you want to save the bottom graphs with more detail, you can click the countries you're interested in and click Show Hint. The pop-ups will display when you save or print the graphs. To retrieve more detailed data for several countries, use the Query option. Use the options along the left to select the data you want to analyze. A small funnel appears when you hover over one of the options. Click the funnel to change the data. For instance, if I click the funnel next to time, I can choose which years I want data from. The table on the right automatically updates as I make new selections. I can click the funnel next to countries to choose which country I want information on. I'm interested in Morocco and Algeria. Finally, I can click the funnel next to Indicator to select the economic indicator I want to analyze. Make sure to drill down as far as you can when making an indicator selection or you won't be able to view any data. You'll know you're on the bottom level when you no longer see the little arrow appear on the right. I'm going to select Prices, Consumer Prices, and finally Consumer Price Index. Once I have selected all of the data I'm interested in, I can use the options along the top of the table to modify how the data is displayed. I can display the data as a bar graph, pie chart, and more. I can even change the colors of the graph. I can modify the title of the graph. And when everything is formatted just the way I need it, I can click the wheel icon to share the data, print it, or download it. Because we only have access to the free version of the International Financial Statistics, the save and download buttons will not work. Use the wheel to save the data instead. If you use the data in an assignment, make sure to cite your source.